okay. Still flat. But this is receding and this is rising at the same point. So if I take my calipers at the same point that is rising, draw a line, that's where it should recede. Yes, and it started to recede there, so that's pretty good. But this has a little steeper angle. This angle goes more like this. This angle goes like this. So we pay attention to the rate of the way the light speeds. See how this is a little darker? It's a little lighter. Looks light is over there. The sculpting will change your confidence. This line. Okay. Or the same spot. That's a pretty good guess. Right? So now, to be equal, Still spreading out, this a little tighter. being visually unsettling. We call this dynamic asymmetry. It's a good time to step back, step back from the work, take a look at it, see how we've got heavy here, light here. But to make it feel balanced is the trick. This is where stepping back, I can see this line is lining up okay. I can bring a little bit down here. There. Visually, it's working. However, we have all this mass here. Kind of looks like Medusa's hair right now. But this gives me 
a lot of material to work with. Now I can also compare it by the light that falls over on the profile. You can do it to the profile. Everything seems to be working out just fine. So we've got this little flat spot in here, but it's about the same height as there. But this is a different rate, different slope. See that slope there? See that slope? We're going to take that, increase the slope there, increase the hollow. Now I'll check the rate of that curve. It's getting close. And there that slightly flat. You can take a little more out in this area here. Reduce the boss. Clay will not teach you how to work with that type of shape. You have to really think it through. Clay you just kind of fudge back and forth. So it really teaches you to pay attention. Now we're getting that, that, that is almost out. This is like taking dumbbells, 90 pound weekly, and eating a heavy protein diet and taking dumbbells and lifting them every day it strengthens your thinking and your visual process. I'm looking for the, 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 the rate of way the light changes. I can't do it with the single, with this multiple overhead light, so let's change the light. Okay, still flat, but this is receding and this is rising at the same point. So if I take my calipers at the same point that is rising, draw a line, that's where it should recede. Yes, and it started to recede there, so that's pretty good. But this has a little steeper angle. This angle goes more like this. This angle goes like this. So we pay attention to the rate of the way the light speeds. See how this is a little darker? It's a little lighter. Looks light is over there. 